Still unsure about selling shoes on eBay? Watch this video and give you five reasons why you should be. Hey everyone, thanks for stopping in and welcome to another Thrift Union video. My name is Kevin. Today we're going to go over top five reasons why you should be selling shoes on eBay. So without further ado, let's get right into it. Oh, but first, if you like our content, don't forget, give us a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button. All right, so reason number five, easy to ship. Um, basically, get a box, put it in, tape it up, out it goes. Um, shipping shoes couldn't be easier, um, especially if you are US counterparts uh, who have shoe boxes readily available for them, uh, provided by USPS. Uh, for us here in Canada, it can be a little more difficult to get boxes. Uh, Myself, uh, we luck out. Um, I get envelope boxes from uh, my employer um, that fit the shoes perfectly. Uh, but generally, you can find pretty much shoe size boxes um, anywhere, um, even at your grocery store in that uh, that bin where they put all the recycled cardboard where they do want you to take the boxes. You, know, you can even go to shoe stores. Um, never done it myself. Uh, dumpster dive in the back. Uh, obviously, just make sure it is legal where you are. And um, other than that. Go in and ask. Um, I'm sure they would have some uh, boxes that they no longer need and want to get rid of. Uh, if you're not able to come across boxes, we also use a sandwich method. Uh, we basically put the shoes together, uh, toe to heel, uh, and then wrap it in bubble wrap, wrap it in clear wrap, and then stick it in a bag, a uh, poly bag, poly mailer. Never had any problems with that, uh, but box is preferable. Generally, um, higher end shoes we will put in the box. Um, the lower end type shoes would just use the sandwich method, bubble wrap, clear wrap, and then put it in the uh, poly mail. Never had any issues with that. All right, so reason number four. Um, reason number four is they are easy to store. Um, we use shelves, as you can see behind me here. A lot of people do choose to use bins. Um, you can pile quite a sh few shoes in bins. Um, but we tend to use the, the racks. Um, it's definitely much easier for us. Uh, we can visually see them. And we use the Song Mike's um, shoe racks. I highly recommend these. Um, I will link them below. Uh, make sure you check them out if it's something you're interested in. But we definitely do recommend using the Song Mike's uh, shoe rack. Um, it's five across, ten shelves. Uh, so you can fit up to 50 shoes per rack. Um, but yeah, super easy to store. Use the racks, use the bins, um, they're out of the way, it's always up against the wall, so you get lots of space, you can fill a whole wall with these racks. Uh, so, easy to store is our number four. Uh, number three, uh, easy to list. Um, you can't get any easier uh, than shoes. Basically, um, you will find the majority of your shoes when you're doing your search for your comps, uh, looking for the exact model of shoe to get your um, pricing. Um, you generally will find an exact comp for the shoes that you're selling. On the rare occasion, you will not be able to find some. You gotta do a little more research, but generally um, you will find a comparable, um, which makes it easier. You just click on that, sell similar. Um, generally, you just tweak the title a little bit, get your photos. Again, photos we take 10 to 12. Um, Obviously, you want to take as much detailed photos as you can. If there's any wear, you definitely want to be highlighting that. Um, but it definitely is really easy to list. Shoes, mainly because you're going to find a comp in most cases. You're going to be able to use that sell similar button. And as long as you're taking um, and your, your photos, you're usually taking the same photos um, every shoe. So you can get in a nice routine and knowing which, which photo is next. So that is number three. Um, easy to list. Uh, number two. Two, availability. Shoes are everywhere. Uh, from garage sales to thrift stores, everywhere, any of these places you're gonna go, you're gonna find shoes available. Garage sales, you're gonna, generally you can pick them up for 50 cents to one to two dollars. Um, at thrift stores, you're gonna pay a little more. Uh, generally five, you know, and up. Uh, highest I usually see in thrift stores is about uh, 30, 35 dollars. Um, they're everywhere. Um, so number two is the fact that you can pretty much find shoes everywhere. Now, the number one reason to be selling shoes is return on investment. There's not many items that you can sell where you're going to get such a great return on investment. Uh, generally, any time that you spend one to five dollars, these are going to be your bread and butter shoes. Um, you spend one to five, 
these usually you can turn them into 30 to 40 dollars not to say you're not going to find a shoe that is one to five dollars that you could sell upwards you know 80 to 100 uh, but generally if you're spending one to five dollars in our experience you find you're going to earn anywhere from 30 to 40 for that shoe uh, in the five to ten dollar range um, you're generally going to turn from 50 to 100 once again um, that's going to depend I'm not saying you're not going to be able to find a shoe in that price range that you're not going to be able to sell for the higher price spend five to ten generally you're going to be able to flip those into anywhere from 50 to 100 um, and twenty dollars um, if you're spending twenty dollars on a shoe um, usually um, we, we would generally expect to get at least a hundred uh, when we spend twenty dollars on a single pair of shoes um, in most cases um, when you're spending um, a higher um, you usually are obviously going to expect uh, a higher return and that's no uh, no different um, when it comes to selling shoes uh, so that's it pretty quick and sweet uh, but those are the five reasons uh, that you definitely want to be into selling shoes uh, so just to recap number five we got easy to ship number four uh, we got easy to store number three we got easy to list number two availability they're everywhere number one return on investment can't beat it shoes will definitely make you a lot of money uh, so that's it for today um, hope you enjoyed the content don't forget to give us a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button. Thanks for stopping by. Take care, have a good one.